mean, you gotta have some nerve to take care of those zombies. They're not zombies, they've been returned. They're zombies. The return protein works as a barrier. It's kind of like a retaining wall. The incubated virus is always there, but the daily dosage keeps it at a safe distance. These people are time bombs. If they miss just one dosage, one, there's no going back. Point on this, point on this. Six years ago, I was returned. We haven't received the stuff from the lab this week. What? There's seven dead return at St. John's Hospital and 12 at Central. They can't be sure it was the anti-return groups, but it doesn't look good. We're safe here. No, we're not. Please don't hurt me. I want to be normal. What the hell's going on? I have less than 24 hours. Do you understand that? <laughs> Just go and check the injections. Just go. I can't help you now, Cage. So what do you suggest I do? Just stand around and watch him die? Mm, did you like that? Now, I've got more news on Jason Statham not returning for the transporter 4, 5 and 6. So, now that he has opted out of playing Frank Martin, British actor Ed Scream, best known for playing Dario Naharis on HBO's Game of Thrones, has been set to take his place. The new film will be a reboot and will take the story back to the original Transporters setting of the French Riviera. The story will give more depth to Frank Martin's character, exploring his relationship with his father. Directed by Camille Delamar, Transporter comes to theater in 2015. Check us out on Facebook Film Is Now and like us to make sure you keep updated on everything Hollywood. Bye bye.